All right. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, back to the apartment. I didn't do that last time, so it's a good thing that I did. Actually, I don't think I did that for the first one either. Oh well. Um, we're back with another taste test video. This time it's baby food because I think everybody tries baby food at least once, especially as a baby. Um, but <laughs> we've actually tried some baby food in the past, but like it was like a dark, dark crevice of history and it doesn't exist anymore. Hope the video got taken down. So um, we're trying baby food. It all is like fruit food because I wasn't about to mess with veggies or meat. So we got fruit. Um, so we're going to start with these. I'm just going to show you as I, as we try them because the rest are over there. We have quite a bit, so. Um, and my cat may or may not try some stuff as well. I'm pretty sure it'll be fine for them because it's fine for babies, so. His bowl's right here, and he is on the other side. Toby, come here. Come here. Okay, he's up here now. Let's see if we can get him to come into the shot. Okay. So, um, we each have our spoons, we each have our cups, um, if we don't finish something, it'll go to the church, there are babies there, I'm sure they'll eat it, um, however, I do have pretty high hopes, so, first things we're gonna try are these Paw Patrol fruit puree pouches, um, which exist for older kids slash adults, so. I'm not looking forward to any of the mushy stuff, so the purees. Not high hopes. Sarah's a texture person. But it's mostly just going to be like applesauce. So. What one is this one? This one is apple, mango, and peach. Toby! Well, I... Toby! I eat one of those things. <laughs> Playing Toby. with things anyway. Come here! Come here, my love. You want to come up here and try it? Come on. I got the cat. Here's the cat. Where's the cat? Toby. Hey, Toby. 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 Okay. You want me to hold the spoon? Toby. Come here, bud. Oh, butt face. Look over here. It's in there. All right, cat tries it first. You've got to realize that it's in there. Here, look, right there. Cat's a fan. He will eat anything, though. Yeah. Willow will maybe make an appearance. He's easier to wrangle. I get maybe apple. I get mango, I think. Well, both of those ingredients are in there. He's not a fan. He's left us. He's not a fan. That's cool. That's fine. That's whatever. I have a bag that I'll just put in there if you guys don't like it. I don't think he's going to come back. I think he's going to nib in your mom's bag. Hmm? Well, if he comes back, it's hair. Which one do you want next? Blue. Blue. Let me make sure that this is on, actually. Do you have to refrigerate them now that they're open? I don't know. I think they usually just eat these in one go, so. I don't think it matters. I'll probably put them in the fridge, though. You don't have a whole lot in there, so. So this one is uh, apple, banana, and blueberry. I feel like the one mm. on this one's going to be mostly banana. I'm hoping for blueberry. If you don't know my struggle with bananas. It just looks like the exact same. Maybe slightly darker. Yep, that's mostly banana. I like that one better, though. I'm sad. That one's pretty good. I like that one. We aren't rating them. <laughs> Just basically, if you like them, yeah, then you like them. I guess if we rate them, I'll give this one a three. We could simply just do a thumbs up or thumbs down. Okay. So what about this one? That one I liked more. 
This one I'm going to give it a sideways. Like I said, it's a three for me, mm -hmm. so I kind of like it, but I kind of don't. This one is a thumbs up for me. Sad. I like that one a lot. Um, Let's do this one. This one is apple, pear, and strawberry. Ooh, that was a lot. I'm sorry. That's a good thing I like apples. Most of these are mostly like applesauce, but... Yeah. That one straight up just tastes like <laughs> applesauce. Yeah, that one's good. Might convince Sarah to finish that one. Probably won't. Um, I don't know. I'll give her the option. Um, I'll say a thumbs up for that one. Yeah, thumbs up for sure. So that leaves only that one for those types. This one is um, apple, banana, raspberry, and strawberry. Mm. I'm really hoping the raspberry comes through because I love raspberry. Raspberry is really good. Okay. <laughs> don't know if you saw that, but I just kind of got a chunk. Here you go. Can you try a little bit? No. Turn around. Here. I appreciate that he's at least like sniffing at it and like, what the crap is this crap? That one I get the banana and the raspberry. Sideways for me. I think I'll give it a sideways too. Alright, let's <clears> take <throat> a pause out of those mushy ones and let's do these guys. Okay, so these are the little crunchies. These are basically like cheese puffs, but like they're not. Um, so I have garden tomato, uh, mild cheddar, and vanilla maple, which sounded really good. Mm -hmm. So let's go ahead. We'll start with the garden tomato. I'm not sure how to feel about that. I'm hoping it'll be like the garden harvest, whatever, like with them. Like the sun, sun chips. chips. They smell good. They smell like the pizza Pringles. Yes. So this is what they look like. They look like little cheese puffs. Which is cool. Mm. Cheers. Mm. They're good. Fair amount of spice on them for a baby snack. I might give it a medium. I like them. I'll give them a thumbs up. Well, that's mostly because Sarah doesn't like spice. I do not like spice. I have texture issues and I have spice issues. I like them. I could see you just buying like five of each. I mean, they're cheaper than some adult things, so. <laughs> Let's save that one for last, if you want to. I don't care. That's your pick. This is one that we did try in the past, and I remember we did like it because, like. I mean, it's cheese. There's nothing to not like about it. It's basically a baby Cheeto. Yeah. So that's what it looks like. Cheese. Oh, yeah, those are still good. Mm hmm. Thumbs up all the way. Fact two. Wow. Yeah, thumbs up. That one I'll have to share with Sarah. <laughs> and I, I don't, I'm not here all the time, so she could easily just inhale it while oh, I'm yeah. here. You see, Here's what I like about these compared to like regular Cheetos mm -hmm. is they're smaller and they're not as dense as a regular Cheeto, so they don't get stuck in your teeth as much. Fair. I hate that about Cheetos. So those I could definitely see myself inhaling at like three in the morning. Gremlin mode. Oh yeah. And lastly is the maple vanilla. I am interested in that. <gasps> oh, it smells so good. And I'm sorry, it smells like syrup. I love it. It smells so good. I have such high hopes. Please don't disappoint me. What do you want? 
He wants a puff. Here, you want a cheesy one? Here, you want a puff? Have okay, a cheesy yeah, one. that's really, that smells good. And Toby's gonna like the puff. He's, he's licking it. He's gonna eat it. This smells so good. The flavor isn't super duper strong. Mm -hmm. You trying to take your Cheeto and run? Yeah. Where'd it go? Uh, did you drop it? Probably. I don't know. I'll give him one of these ones because there's really not much to it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's another thumbs up, but I don't think it's a double <coughs> thumbs up for me. No, I think this one's honestly. I think I might give this one a side. Really? Like, it smells amazing, and honestly, the flavor's not bad. It's just very, 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 very light. Fair. Um, so, yeah. But I do like it. But I feel like if that one was super duper flavorful, it could be overpowering, like super duper sweet. So, I can see why it's not. Um, but I, yeah, it's good. I am once more into the mushy. Mushy. So these are the jarred baby foods. I just went with the fruit ones, of course. We've got <clears throat> apple, banana. This one is banana cinnamon granola. Ooh. So fancy. Pear and raspberries and pear and pineapple. Like I said in my haul, I think, I wasn't, or maybe I said at the Willow wants Toby's puff, and <laughs> he does not want to give it to her. Here, there's another puff. Willow, here. There's your own puff. Maybe these ones will be for the cats. They seem to like it. Um, anyway, we were not about to mess with the meat or the veg or any of the other chaos. Yeah, my cats like them, so <laughs> that's a bonus. So we just got the fruity ones because that seems like the least offensive. So, which one do you want to start with? This one, which is apple. So, this one should, in all theory, be just applesauce. Maybe just a little bit. Less, like, I don't know. Yeah, it's just, it just smells like applesauce. Not a big fan of applesauce, honestly. <laughs> That's literally just applesauce. Yep. It's good. Mm. Honestly, though, like, this is about the amount of applesauce that I can tolerate. Apparently, you can heat it up if you want to. Mm. It says open before heating. I don't know why anybody would heat up applesauce, but mm. whatever. Okay. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and do... Pear and raspberries. Yeah. Smells very much of apples. Ooh, it's very watery, very liquidy. There's some on the other side as well. Okay. The difference between our two spoons is great. It's good. I can't place what it's meant to actually be, though. It's pears. Pears and raspberries. I can't get any of that. It mostly tastes like applesauce. Again. But, like, if you've ever had pears and you know the texture of a pear, mm -hmm. it has that texture. Like, not so much gritty, but, like, that... Oh, so that's what that is? Yeah, that's, like, the that's the texture of a pear. Oh, I, I don't do that. Yeah. Mm. I don't really know how to describe it, but if you've ever had a pear, it's the texture of a pear. Mm. More pear. This oh. one's pear and pineapple. I feel like pineapple has a better chance of actually... Overpowering it. Like, yeah. No, and also seems like it's going to be on the runny side. No more crunchy. I'll give you the puffs in a minute, okay? Did you hear that? Mm. That little mow of protest. You don't want this. This isn't what you liked. Waking Show off. 
he's gonna be real disappointed when he realizes that the puffs aren't gonna happen just yet. Mm hmm So this one is pear and pineapple. Mm -hmm. Yeah. A lot of that like, grit. Yeah, it still has the grit of the pear, but it does definitely taste of pineapple. Mm -hmm. It's eh. pretty good. Oh, I forgot to do the. Uh, it, for, it's like, literally the, past, like, the same for the all three. That's I because think, I don't do that. I think I'll give them all a thumbs up. Mm -hmm. Honestly, like you know, none of them has made me want to throw up, which is great. Yeah. This one is banana. So it should not have grit, at least, for Sarah's sake. Banana. I am kind of confused as to why the banana is slightly orangey pink. We're not going to talk about it, though. What the crap did they put in that? Hmm? Why is it sour? It's very banana. It Thumbs down. It's not bad. I don't like it. I'll give it a sideways thumbs up. Here, Dobie, you want to try some banana? Let's see your bowl. Here. He's just over here waiting. Let me, let me show you. See, he's just waiting. Did you try the banana, dude? Nope. <laughs> Hi, Toby. He's so cute. Um, okay, moving on. This is the... These are hard to put back on. I don't really want to go back on. Last of the jars. This is the banana cinnamon granola. Now I know for a fact there's probably going to be grit in this because of the granola, but and I'm hoping the cinnamon overpowers it all. <clears throat> yes, my love. I'll get you something in a minute. I mean, yes, in a way. Oh, I don't like that one. Definitely a side. I don't like that one. I won't finish that one. I'll probably finish the others. I don't like that one. Yeah. Well, hopefully your dino biscuits will help. So these are dino biscuits with pro no prebiotics, which is great. Um, these are the blueberry yogurt flavor. Did he find it? Yeah. Toby, look at him go. Hold on, let me get these bags out of the way. Okay. <clears throat> so these are the blueberry yogurt flavor. They also had banana flavor, I believe, but I didn't feel like getting the other one. We already had a lot of banana stuff, so. I can't smell anything. I'm kind of congested a little bit, so. Um, I mean, I smell something, but I don't know what it is. Let me just do this real quick. So, let's see which dino I get. I get one of these guys. What dino will you get? A triceratops. Oh my goodness. I think those are literally your only options, so we got one of each. Mm -hmm. there. I do like blueberry, so I'm very hopeful. Mm -hmm. They're very dry. Mm -hmm. They're not bad, though. Mm -hmm. It's not fully a thumbs up, but it's not fully a thumbs to the side. Mm -hmm. Next, we have kind of a combo, apparently. 
We have two yogurt bites. Oh, that, that, it's still in the yogurt category. Yeah. And we have this like yogurt stick thing. Mm -hmm. So let's go ahead. We'll do the banana, banana yogurt bites. The dino was technically a yogurt bite as well. Mm -hmm. But I didn't get any yogurt. Okay, you want to try one of those? As I throw it at you? <clears throat> so this is what they look like. They're just little freeze-dried drops of yogurt. I don't know they freeze-dried them. Now, full disclosure, we did try the peach ones already because I was impatient and wanted to try them. These ones are a little bit better. As you can probably tell by Sarah's face, they taste very strongly of banana. I really like the texture of these. These are good. My mouth is sad. I'll try this one. I'm very interested in the fact that it's stick. Yeah. It's an organic berry yogurt pick me stick. So we did eat the yogurt milk, by the way. Mm. Ooh. So they're like big, like corn puff sticks. Mm. Toby's interested by this one. He's over here on my lap. They kind of have the texture of like um, Andy's fries, if you've ever had any of those. So. I like the texture. I'm not sure I'm getting any of the fruit. The flavor is like very, 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 very faint. But I love the texture. Mm. Mm. I'll give them a sideways because the flavor's not there, but... They'll go same. I do really like that texture, so... Let's go eat those. Mm. <clears throat> what about you? Did you eat yours? Mm. Did you eat yours? Toby's not a fan. Oh, no. The last one. I can't get those back in the thing. It's no, that's alright. You're just gonna inhale them probably later. We have is. Hey, you want that? The cherry vanilla yogurt melts. Yeah. You'd rather just play with the stick. These ones are purple. have high hopes for this one as well. Mostly because I do quite like cherry. They're purple. Hmm. I like the banana ones better, but they're okay. They're a wee bit sour. So should we do something to wash it down? Sure. Do that one the sides? Probably same. <clears throat> so we've got two juices. Um, fun fact. I got the parents' choice juice, but I remember when Gerber, you used to be able to get juice in like a jar like that. And my brother and I would drink that juice until we were like five. <laughs> Full disclosure. So got parents choice this is apple juice and pear juice so which one do you want pear. apple or pear give me pear i wish to know what a pear actually tastes like when it's not surrounded by all the other fruits you want a lot or that's fine <laughs> be going on a little journey to see if i like pears would you like some juice toby
He doesn't know what to think about it. Mm, well, she's yeah. used to only getting juice and not juice, water and milk, so. That was good. Yep. It's good. No, give it a thumbs up. Why not? So then we have apple. Did he actually drink any of it? No. Apple juice is one of those things where I don't think you could screw it up that much. Though I was He's more... kind of drinking it. He doesn't know what he thinks, though. More but... a fan of orange juice growing no, you up. Can't, you can't bury it. Toby, you have a puff stuck on your foot. Uh, whenever I went to youth camp, they only really had apple. I already gave you some. Oh. Yeah, I gave myself some, too. Oh. I was explaining my camp story. How I usually preferred orange, but I had no choice but to drink apple, because that's all they had. I was distracted by a cat. So, I don't know. I have a love-hate relationship with apple juice. I like apple juice. That one is definitely one of the better ones that I've had. I'll give it a thumbs up. Toby... Toby is going into the bag void. So, all right. Next, we are on to the rusks and and cookies. Yep. Um. So we have two rusks and a cookie. So we'll probably just do what we did before and just sandwich it in between. That works for me. So we're gonna start with the organic apple rice rusks. Um, I think these are used for um, teething, but we're just gonna take a bite of. Quite a lot of them. Dang. Definitely could probably split just the one pack because I think that comes with two. So they immediately remind me of communion wafers. Oh, no. <laughs> so the question is, are you going to taste like a communion wafer? It's supposed to be apple flavored. So we'll see. Honestly, I wasn't expecting it to taste so much like apple. Honestly, I'm not getting much of a flavor. It's more so the initial bite that's flavor. Mm -hmm. Ow! Why are you climbing me? I'm not a tree. They're good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like texture. It is stuck in your teeth, though. Hmm. This is the last time I have to deal with evil banana. Banana cookies. I have to check my leg when I climb this one. Because your boy tried to climb me like a tree. Yeah. I think that was one of your more expensive things that you got. Yeah. These banana cookies. I was either going to get these or the arrowroot cookies, which are super, like, popular, but mm, I kind of just wanted something with flavor. Can you tell? I need scissors. Don't do that. They're going to go flying if you do that. They are not going to go flying. I think said it is rather hard to open. Which is why I said get scissors. Ha! Got it. And they didn't go flying. If they would have, I would have punched you. <clears throat> Especially after mentioning how they were the most expensive item that I bought. She just hit your cat in the bag. I did. Now this is his smiley banana. Happy banana. It 
It's not very strong. No. It's basically just like a vanilla wafer. Yes. I'm not bad. <laughs> not worth being the most expensive thing here. Oh yeah. <laughs> Blueberry rasps. <clears throat> so these are the same thing as the strawberries, not apples. They did have strawberry, and I they had a diff another one as well, but I can't remember what it was. And other brands have other flavors. Like I know Gerber. We went with the parents' choice ones because. Is cheaper. But I know Gerber had a peach one that I'd probably be interested in trying at some point. I think Toby will like these too because of the texture. Oh, they're purple. Hmm. I have higher hopes for these ones than I had with the original ones. Give me the bag. Give me the bag. Maybe it's just because of the color. Can't smell much. It's very faint, but it is there. But I think it's slightly more there than the other one was. I like the texture of these a lot. Mm. I'm going to take one of these with you on the trip. Okay. This one's definitely gets stuck in your teeth. These are the last things in the taste test. They are the puffs, which I also think the cats are going to love. So these ones are apple cinnamon. These ones I will not give them because of the cinnamon. I also have peach, which I want to save for last because I love peach. And blueberry, which they can have. Assuming they'll actually eat it. I think it's like cereal or... We've had them something. in the past, I think. Hey, Toby. Toby. Toby's a fan. As my human friend just waits. So they're little stars. Puff grain snack, blueberry. Mm. It's a very light blueberry, but it's still good. It mostly just tastes like cereal. It does taste like, kind of like Fruit Loops almost. Yeah, or Fruity Pebbles. I don't know the difference. Fruit Loops are the circle ones. With I the hole between the, the taste. I don't know. One's Fruit Loops, one's Fruity Pebbles. Okay, this one is the apple cinnamon. Which is the one I'm looking forward to. Anything with cinnamon. Typically. I love cinnamon. I don't really have much of a smell. Mm -hmm. Oh, I got three this time. Okay, here. But ironically, I think I like the blueberry one more. Blueberry was definitely a thumb up. That one's almost a full thumb up, but not exactly. This one's definitely a lot more of an aftertaste mm -hmm. of apple cinnamon. That's not bad. And to the final thing of this taste test. 
the peach ones, which I'm excited about. I hope they do. I just keep gaining an extra one per. So this one, I got four this time for this flavor. Here's the star. Mm, yep, that tastes like peach. That's very peachy. Eh. I like it. It's very strong, but that's why I'm giving it an eh. So what's your favorite thing? <clears throat> Out of everything we've tried? I think I already know what your favorite thing is going to be. <laughs> oh? I do quite Not really like... One. This one. I do really like this one, but I really like the blueberry out of this one, too. Mm -hmm. Fair. I really like the garden tomato. Mm -hmm. And I really like these. Mm -hmm. Mostly for the, um, the texture. Weirdness. I like the texture a lot. Now, don't get me wrong. I did really like those, like, wafer things. But mm -hmm. they didn't have a very strong flavor to them. Yeah. But again, it's for baby. Babies aren't going to care. Baby's just going to say, hey, food's here. Cool. But yeah, overall, least favorite thing. The banana thing. Honestly, we agree. The banana cinnamon granola. Least favorite overall. Do not recommend. Toby has returned for another crunchy. Oh no. These are Toby's favorite. Is the vanilla maple ones. Here, take one. Come on, get one. He yeah. wants you to hand it to him. He doesn't want you to actually just open it for him. What, you don't want that one? Okay, I think he wants to try these guys again. But no, sir. No. No. But we gotta run. Be camera shy. Tiffany has to go deal oh, with sorry. taking yeah. her mom's stuff upstairs. And I need to go home to feed their sister. Woo. Bye.